Correcting Common Errors Mastering Time Adverbs in English Hello, language learners. In today's video, we're going to delve into a fascinating topic. Adverbs of Time. Specifically, we'll address how to correctly use them and rectify common mistakes. So, buckle up and let's decode the secrets of English grammar. First, let's quickly recap what we already know. Adverbs of time provide information about when something happens. They can tell us if an event occurs in the past, present, or future, or how frequently it happens. Examples include yesterday, now, tomorrow, and often. Often, even experienced English speakers make mistakes with adverbs of time. For instance, they may use always and usually interchangeably or place an adverb incorrectly in a sentence. Don't worry if this sounds familiar. It's a common mistake, but one we can easily correct. Here is the fun part, correcting the mistakes. Here are a few examples. Incorrect. I usually am going to the gym after work. Correct. I usually go to the gym after work. In the correct sentence, we place, usually, before the main verb, go. Incorrect. Yesterday, I've seen a movie. Correct. Yesterday, I saw a movie. In the corrected sentence, we use the simple past, saw, instead of the present perfect, have seen, because, yesterday, is a specific point in the past. Now, it's your turn to practice. Let's correct these sentences together. 1. I often am eating pizza on Fridays. 2. Tomorrow, I will have finished my project. 3. Usually, I've had coffee in the morning. Pause the video here and try to correct these on your own. When you're ready, continue the video for the answers. Corrected sentences. 1. I often eat pizza on Fridays. 2. Tomorrow, I will finish my project. 3. Usually, I have coffee in the morning. And that wraps up our exploration of correcting mistakes with adverbs of time. Remember, practice makes perfect, so keep practicing these structures until they feel natural. Thank you for joining us today. Stay curious and keep learning.